All right, everybody. Hello, and welcome back to another video. I am iPro Hobby, and today we are playing some more Stardew Valley. And our goal for the day is to catch the rest of the summer fish and maybe possibly upgrade our house if we can earn enough money. So we're going to start out by um, picking up our crops. We got some tomatoes and hot peppers. Is this wheat ready? It's not yet. Oh, but we have some hops ready. So we will get that stuff. And I think we're also going to try to stop by the community center and... Um, focus on maybe crafting some sprinklers because I think I want to start getting more efficient with our watering because I'm getting really tired of having to water stuff all the time. So this is our community center chest. No, I forget how I organize my own chest. Okay, this is our community center chest. So let's hover over these items. What do we need for? We do need tomatoes. So I need a tomato. Let's go up to this community center. Thing actually and check it out okay come on there we go okay so these are our summer crops yeah so we need it for that and we're still waiting on our blueberries and our melons to finish I think our melons will be ready tomorrow and then we'll have that ready to go so we have some things that we can donate today so I think we're going to start with fishing actually because we, some of the, the fish that we need to catch are kind of difficult. Um, we can sell that egg too. Oh yeah, and we also were going to upgrade our pickaxe. So we can drop off our pickaxe to Clint and then go fishing. So let's, oh, I don't want to sell all of those. I don't want to, <laughs> just let me save like two of them, please. And save another hot pepper. We can sell those. Sell that. And yeah, we'll drop off our pickaxe to Clint. Okay, first we gotta water all of these crops. <clears throat> and then I gotta remember what else we need to catch. I think the Dorado is one that we need to catch. Oops. And then what else was it? I have my little checklist pulled up next to me on my iPad. Oh, and the tilapia. I think that was the other one that we still had left to catch. And then I want to finish, hurry up and get those all caught and finished up so that we can focus on other aspects of the game. Like I said, I want to work on getting sprinklers set up and like a more organized crop layout here. And then I also want to work towards upgrading the house and getting the kitchen and everything set up so that we can start romancing some more to try and get Sam since he's who we're working towards for this playthrough. So maybe we'll stop by and give him a Joja Cola or something too. Oh, I guess we can check the fruit bat cave too for other community center stuff. Okay, so now let's head over to Clint and drop that off right away because I don't think we're going to do any mining in this part just because we finished off last time with that and the spirits are at least unhappy today, and who knows, they probably will be tomorrow too because they're just that finicky. Little, little shitheads. Check the trash cans while we're in town. There's times where it's like, time feels like it passes so slowly in this game, and other times it passes so quickly, it's ridiculous. Okie dokie. On to Clint. Hello, Clint, my friend, old buddy, old pal. Let's talk to you first. Weather doesn't really matter to me. I typically stay near my shop year-round. Depressing, huh? Just a little bit, Clint. Just a little bit. Um, upgrade tools. Copper pickaxe. To oh, dang it. Okay, never mind. We don't have enough money. So off to fishing we, uh, we go. <laughs> okay, so we need the octopus. Um, I just lost my train of thought. We need the octopus, the tilapia, the dorado, and the crimson fish. So we're going to go to the ocean first to try and get the octopus and the tilapia. Ooh, let's grab this pretty little rainbow shell while we're here and check out this artifact spot. Nice, lost book. Okay, so octopus tilapia. Get your fingers crossed, get ready. Hope, pray, whatever you do. And let's get into it. I guess we should, we could also fill our crab pot too. So, these ones are available until, I believe the octopus is available until 1 p.m. And the uh, tilapia is available until 2 p.m. 
And then Dor- the Dorado is in the forest until 7. And then the Crimson Fish is in its specific spot, but it can be caught any time of day. So that one's kind of bottom of the tier list right now, bottom of the priority list, just because also I want to get as high of a fishing level as I can before going after that, just because it is a legendary fish, so it's a bit more difficult. And yeah, so we're just chilling, going along. We're doing pretty good so far, I think, for this perfection run. I know it's like kind of speed run, kind of not, because I do want to get things as quickly as possible. I want to get as much done in the first year as possible, but... You know, it is what it is. If it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Oh, nice. Look at that. We got a tilapia. And a treasure chest. Beautiful. Okay, so now hopefully we can get an octopus while we're here. And also while we're in the forest, we can check out the traveling cart to see if she's got anything for us. And yeah, I think it'll be pretty good. Pretty good day. I think it'll be nice and productive in this video, hopefully. Oh, now I'm catching all the tilapia. Now that I don't need them. <laughs> I just need an octopus. We only have until one to catch octopus. Yeah, okay, of course. Now that I'm, I caught one tilapia, I'm gonna catch a million of them. Just, just my luck. Come on, let it be an octopus. Oh, another treasure chest. Look at that. Oh, did we get that in time? Oh, we did, nice. Oh, we got a diamond in that one. I've already got a red mullet. All right, 12.20. Come on, let this be the octopus, please. Please, 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 please. Nope, it's a tuna. Okay. 12.20, we got 12.30, 30 minutes. Okay, come on. Come on, octopus. Come on, octopus. Please. <sighs> Seaweed. Okay, we're not gonna get an octopus. We can say hello to Haley. Hi, Haley. I wonder what Alex is doing today. Huh? I didn't notice you standing there. Okay, then, Haley, be that way. Off to the forest we go. Hey, there's Sam. Oh, no, I didn't think that through. <laughs> Did that, like, majorly lower? Okay, we still have one heart with him. Shoot, I did not think that through. Why did I do that? Why am I like this? Why are you like this? Okay, let's go see Traveling Car Lady while we recover from how we just embarrassed ourselves in front of our crush. Hello. Gate, cave carrot, cranberry, candy, coal. You really don't got much. You got the rare seed, but we can't afford it. And same with the coffee bean, dang it. Time to go to the river and try to get to Dorado. We have until seven. Come on, Dorado friend. Oh, we got something. We hooked something. Probably gonna be a carp. <laughs> Knowing my luck. Oh no, a rainbow trout. That's a little better. It'll sell for a bit more money. <sighs> Chub. Yeah, most of this other stuff we can't catch yet. I'm kind of holding off on some of the special fish, like the ones I think can be caught in the mines, just because those can be caught year round. Oh my goodness, you springy little fuck. Stay right there. Dang it, no, it's just a pike. I already have a pike. Hey, my friend, this is just not your day, my friend. It's just not gonna be our day, is it? Once closing time happens for the Dorado, I think we're gonna go to the community center and drop off anything, see if we can complete any bundles. I am feeling less and less lucky the longer the day goes on here. Oh, at least we can get a treasure chest. We have one hour left of in-game time before the Dorados go to sleep. So, I don't know what's gonna happen. Another sunfish. Well, hopefully we can make some decent money at least with all these extra fish that we've got today. We've got one more chance probably, and if we don't hook something by seven, then we're done for. Oh, maybe, will this be it? Will this be it? I doubt it. Nope. Okay, so we are done here today. Hey! Closing time! Oh, that's right. We can check on Eggman while we're down here. Oh, we got two eggs from Eggman. Thank you. Oh, you're trying to sleep. Fine then. Be that way. I guess I should switch over to my sword since... Oh my goodness. We can start getting creatures spawning any moment now. Alright, off to the community center we go. 
I don't know if we're gonna actually complete any bundles with this stuff, but I hope we do so we can earn some kind of prize. Here we are. Hello, Junimo friends. Start with the fish. I don't remember which one. Here we go. Oh yes, we get to complete the ocean fish bundle. Oh, I grabbed the wrong thing. I grabbed the blackberry instead of the red snapper. Okay. Yay, bundle complete. What do we get? What do we get? Warp totems to the beach. What's this? Walleye. We can't catch that yet. So now we just need a walleye, a tiger trout, and all these special guys. Nice. Okay, anything here? Nothing for that one. I think I have... Yeah, I have the gold ore for this one. Blacksmith bundle. Oh, nice. We completed a second one. What do we get from you? Furnace. We just need the fire quartz now. We need to get down to that part of the mine so that we can get the mine carts because the mine carts make travel so much easier before you are able to get a horse. And then we can go over here to the crafts room. Summer crops. Drop off my tomato. Oh, I should have saved an egg. I'm dumb. I need to save an egg for the animal bundle next time. Okay, and our energy is basically in the gutter. Can I talk to you guys? If you and Maru become friends, I'm sure she'll show you how to use that telescope out back. Pretty exciting, huh? And Robin, we're pretty insulated from the rest of the world here in Stardew Valley. It has its pros and cons. Thanks, guys. Oh, yeah. Oh. Hello, Seb. Oh, hey. Yawn. Okay, cool. And what's the quest on the quest board? Buying one topaz three times the market value. Please deliver directly to me. Oh, I'll accept that just in case we have one. I don't remember if we have one or not. And tomorrow is Alex's birthday. Oh, Sam's birthday is next week. We're going to have to plan ahead for that. I guess while we're up, we can go and say hello to anyone who's in the saloon. Get some friendship building. Hello, Pam. Oi, Gus, give me another pie on your strongest. Hi, Gus. Emily, if I wasn't so busy, I'd come help you on the farm. But Gus would be upset if I had another job. It's all good, sis. We get it. We understand. Hobby? You look puzzled. I guess the hot summer air can make us a little dizzy. Okay, then. You can use the tapper to harvest syrups and other useful liquids directly from trees. It's a slow process, but the result can be quite valuable. That's what we should do, too. We need to work on tappers. Marnie doesn't seem to notice that you're there. Good evening. It's nice to see you socializing with the townsfolk. It's good to stop by once in a while and see what the latest news is. And Pierre, I've been working hard all week and deserve a little relaxation on a Friday night. Handling salty fish all day makes me real thirsty. What about you, Clint? Oh, I already talked to you today. Shane, what's the point of life if all you do is work? Shane's spitting straight facts right there. I'll buy it. Uh, no, I don't want to waste my money on a Joja Cola. I'm sure I can fish one up from my farm to give to Sam. Time to head to bed. Let's see what we got today. Let's see how much money we made from all those fishies. We got almost 4,000 gold. Looks like we're going to Clint this time. So Clint, then beach to hopefully catch our octopus. Hello. What's our weather? Tomorrow's going to be clear and sunny. Fortune teller. Spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Yeah, it's definitely a good thing that we didn't decide to go to the mines this time. Ah, uh, Clint. Well, I know a couple of recipes. I thought I'd send you one. Maybe it'll help you mine ore or something. <laughs> Take care. He said this algae soup. And our melons are ready. And our wheat is ready as well. So we can throw these in here. I think we need 10 wheat for the community center. So we can take these and sell them. We also need a melon. And we need hay. Cool. Cool beans. And then toss some other stuff in here. And then we have more hops ready because they are ready every day after they are fully grown. I should probably save some of the hops so that I can make some drinks. I'll just sell the higher quality ones. 
once I'm able to make cakes, that is. Okay, so Clint isn't open yet. Um, I guess we can just work to the beach. Let's do that. So then we can get there a lot faster. So we can get our octopus. And then, well, yeah, since the octopus is, oops, I went the wrong way. The octopus is only around to one, so Clint will still be open after that. So after we either catch the octopus or it hits one o'clock, we can run to Clint's, drop off our pickaxe. Oh, I forgot to grab the freaking copper bars. Whoa, whoa, what the fuck, bro? So never mind, we'll go back to the farm and grab the copper bars. And then go to Glint, and then go try to catch Dorado. That's the plan. Come on, octopus. Ooh, treasure chest. Oh, oh. <sighs> Flounder. Can I still catch an octopus in the rain? I feel like you should be able to. Yeah, it's any weather, so we should be fine there. We are not having much luck again today. I'm literally catching everything but what I need. Ooh, maybe this is it. This one started out fast. I know the octopus are kind of, they, they're jumpy. Maybe. Nope, it's freaking tuna. Oh, Jesus Christ. I think that might have been an octopus. They are very difficult. Their difficulty rating is 95. So... That was probably an octopus and I just failed miserably. Okay, we basically got one more cast to get an octopus today. Okay, it's 12.50. Oh, we got one. We got a hit. This is not going to be an octopus, I can already tell. We can at least get the treasure chest then and then go grab our copper bars and head to Clint. Red snapper. Oh, we got some good stuff from there at least. So while we're at Clint's, we can also stop by and see Gunther and drop off those artifacts at the museum. Hopefully we can make it back to Clint's in time. It's already one o'clock and I think he closes at four. Oh, I wonder if we can go to the secret woods now. I think, I think the logs are just a copper ax. Maybe we can do that today too. After we finish trying to catch the Dorado. So let's grab one, two, three, four, five. And head to Clint's and Gunther's and then we'll see what time it is. And if it's worth trying to catch a Dorado or if we should check out the secret woods instead. Because I know that there are red mushrooms in the secret woods in the summertime. And I think also Fiddlehead Ferns, which we need both of those for the community center. And I picked up a quest for Jody that requested a red mushroom. So we can check on those and then that'll probably be it for the day, honestly. Unless we have time to stop by the community center again. All right, Clint. I would like you to upgrade my pickaxe now, please. Beautiful. Okay, now on to Gunther to drop off the stuff that we just got from that treasure chest. Nice. Okay, and then... Oh, no reward, though. That's unfortunate. Okie dokie. Time to head to the forest. Sam isn't out here today, so we can... Ooh, look at that. I got a bream. Wait, I think I need that for the community center. I'm pretty sure. I don't think I've got one yet. Let's go to the fish tank. Oh, no, I do already have one. Dang it. I got really excited. I thought we just got a free community center item. All right, Dorado. I swear to God, today you will be mine. Tomorrow, my love. Tomorrow, you will be mine. Please. So yeah, okay, 3.50 in game. So it gives us about three hours to try and catch the Dorado. If we don't catch one by then, we will head to the secret woods because I'm pretty sure I can break down that log now that I have a copper axe. And we will collect some hardwood. I think we can break stumps with a copper axe. I hope so because I really need the hardwood for the community center. Um, I think I, I have five right now and I need 10 to complete that last bundle in the um, blacksmith type section of the community center and the construction bundle, that's the last thing I need. And then we can have the mine carts repaired, which would be like hella nice. So we can get around town a lot faster and a lot easier. 
What are you, Shad? Oh, nice. I got another artifact. These treasure chests are doing us good today, at least. And now that I have two diamonds, I can actually take one of those to Gunther, too, next time we head over there. Another Shad. How sad. <laughs> Even if you guys don't think I'm funny, I think I'm funny. <laughs> okay, this one's a little finicky. Maybe, maybe it'll be a Dorado. Nope, it's Pike. Dang it, we got two hours left in game for a Dorado. Okay, this is basically gonna be our last chance here. Okay, if this isn't a Dorado, I'm giving up and we're going to the secret woods. And it's not, it's a bream. Okay, off to the secret woods we go. We'll pick up the sweet pea too, why not? Um, okay, let's get our axe ready. Does it work? Oh, dang it! Well, I guess since we're over here, we might as well say hi to the wizard. So I guess it has to be iron axe? That's freaking redonkulous. Well, I guess we're gonna need to go to the mines again <laughs> here soon to get more iron to upgrade our axe. Hello, Rasmodius. Stormy days are the only time I can commune with certain elementals. I don't expect you to understand. Okay, cool. Cool, dude. All right. Let's... What else can we do today? I mean, I guess we go to the community center again, but... I don't know what all we're gonna... We're not gonna finish any bundles, I don't think, today. I guess we, we can clean up the farm a little bit. That might be a good idea. We'll start up by the house. Oh, jeez. You just spawned right in front of me, my guy. Okay. Pretty low on energy is the only downside. Let's sell all these fish so we can get lots of money. Yet again. Doopy 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 doop. Okay. Now, we can clean up a bit. Let's... Get rid of some of this hay. Oh, we're gonna have to multitask here. I'm gonna move my scythe over here as well as my axe. We just won't be able to clear off any of the stones since I dropped that off to um, Clinty Clint. But we can take care of the rest of these like logs and stuff. And clear out um, Larry's little area over here. Well, okay, there's really, <laughs> there's a lot of stones here. Oh, I forgot we have our farm cave now. Can't really see it. There we go. Oh, dang, look at all this stuff we got. Some of this is definitely going to help us out with the community center. That's why I always love the fruit bat cave. And I just want, so I think after, I think we're going to upgrade our axe again next. Oops, oops, bat. I think we're gonna upgrade the axe next again after the pickaxe just so that we can get into the secret woods honestly because I am tired of waiting and it's gonna be our best bet for a red mushroom quickly so we will do that we have so much hay out here I only have one farm animal I guess we should work on building a barn too so I'll do some extra planning for the next uh, video I post of this so that we can have a concrete plan of what to do and try to get it done as quickly as possible. I should really place like more torches around everywhere here. That's going to be about as good as it's going to get right now, I think, because it's getting late. Okay, let's see what we need for the community center first so we can put that stuff away and sell the rest okay so yeah we need the orange and the apricot and the peach okay so save apricot orange peach oh i wanted to sell the silver peach and i don't think i need the rest of this cool I know it's getting late. Let me sell some things and then we can go to bed and put some things away just so that we're organized. Okay, 
now it is bedtime. Okay, let's see what we got for today. Oh, nice, we leveled up our farming. Level six farming. Oh, nice, we got the quality sprinkler, so we can definitely work on that next time. Ooh, forester gatherer. Um, gatherer. We're gonna go with gatherer. Oh, dang, look at that. We have 4,500 gold. Nice. Okay, well, I think that this is where I'm going to end this video. Oh, we got a new achievement, cowpoke. We earned 50K. Okay, um, I'm gonna end this episode right here. So thank you all for watching. Let me know, have you enjoyed the video in the comments down below? And if you enjoyed it, don't forget to like and subscribe as well. Thank you all for watching and I will see you all next time. Bye.